But what was really cool about this place is that you uh, you walked in and there was like a, it was like an old one of those old houses like transformed and um, and I thought this is pretty this is pretty cool. There was like uh, there was string lights everywhere. They had uh, these fountains with these babies like the stone cherubs pissing in the bathtubs everywhere. It was pretty dope. And then you kept going and walking and walking and this thing just keeps going like this outdoor patio just keeps going. There's like a uh, VCR with an NES setup playing <laughs> Super Smash Brothers outside. What are close to both? There's a stage, and I'm like, wow, this is really dope. And uh, you go out, and there's food trucks inside this bar. Two of them. One of them was vegan, serving panini. <laughs> and um, yeah, it was crazy. I I had some food, I had some alcohol, and it was a great time. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Sarah. Yes. It's been ages. You can't rush perfection. Your perfection. Oh, but what you make is not. Excuse <laughs> me? I'm sorry. I married you for your face, not your face. It's so hard to be mad at you. <laughs> I'll just feed it to you right now. I won't even finish this hot sandwich. It's kind of soggy right now. I, I don't know. I, I'd rather you finish it. Because I'm finished with your cooking, but not your heart. God, you have so many conflicting messages. <laughs> hey, I mean, could you, could you at least like throw some seasoning on it? I mean, you're just kind of putting bread in a pan. <laughs> How he, a you sandwich is bread, and cooking things involves a pan. Yes, but you also need to apply heat. Well, the, the pan was hot from when we cooked yesterday. Well, you were hot when we got married. <laughs> oh, now you're not being nice. <laughs> There's no conviction there. You know I get grumpy when my tumbly gets rumbly. Then you should have <laughs> my sandwich. It's just Wonder Bread! Cold Wonder Bread! It's not just Wonder Bread, it's Wonder Bread! Timmy, I'm sorry. Mom, can I have a grilled cheese? Of course. Just turn on the stove. I've been trying to tell you this for years, Sarah. Use the stove. You use it for Timmy, why won't you use it for me? Because he's a child. And he has heat in him. We're old and we don't, so we eat cold food. Your understanding of science is flawed. What's <laughs> like my love for you? <laughs> Again, no confliction, you're just being mean. <laughs> no sugar coating! Not anymore! You always used to sugarcoat, but suddenly today, no more sugar coating. Mom, you're being real slow with that grilled cheese. <laughs> Got a point. So. Can I have at least half of the cheese? You're going to steal food from our son now. <laughs> see how it feels? See how it feels to see someone be angry at you? To insult you? No sugar coat for you! Maybe you have the rumbly tumblies. <laughs> maybe I do. <laughs> maybe maybe we could add heat together. <laughs> I'm in the middle of cooking. <laughs> I mean The stove is on! It's a it's a fire hazard! <laughs> well, I mean, we, the, the kid's in the room, we know where he is. No, 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 no. <laughs> also, our son is in the room! <laughs> I just was saying, turn up the heat a little bit. Whoa, 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 Yo, bro, this is the best club in town, I'm telling you. I'm telling you, you know what, they hook you up. First they say, yo, take a shot. You walk in the door, you take a shot. Yeah, we already, yeah. And then, guess what happens? Yes. Good. Hold on, you a shot. Drunk? Yeah. And as soon as you take that third shot, and this is number three, you ready? Are you sure we should be drinking this this quick? Then the waitress comes with paninis! Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Yo! <laughs> I thought this was a gimmick, but it's real. Isn't it great? Hook me up with that turkey Swiss, Oh, You know how I like it, thank you. <laughs>
see you, Betsy! <laughs> <laughs> I think she's into you. I think so, too! <laughs> your, your sandwich is totally a heart. Oh my god, you're right! I didn't like even... the grease. The grill parts are in the heart! Oh my she god. must have bought a custom grill to fucking do that to the sandwich! <laughs> it's, it's really good, though. You're my best friend. You're my best friend. <laughs> I love going to weird bars with you. Dude, it was like that time that we went to that like, uh, like that bar that had like the fountains. Yeah. And the trucks on the roof, right? That's their oh, what was up with you that? know, trucks and sprout, sprout, tr trucks and Dude, spring, <laughs> spring trucks. I love spring trucks. <laughs> oh. Are you gonna take the controller or not? Yeah. Jeez. God, uh, I forgot. <laughs> After, uh, well, do you have a second controller here? Oh, oh he left one. Awesome, cool. <laughs> After the pinis, <laughs> Smash Bros. <laughs> we'll grab a chair, man. All right, all right, let's do it. This is like my so, so yeah. Remember how you said we were best friends? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> let's sit the game out. Why? I. I got a new best friend, man. We have more in common. Did you go to spring tracks with your best friend? I did. That was our place. You're, uh, you're third serving. Um, Russian yeah, roulette? I, oh I, my I, god! <laughs> <laughs> it's not the time! <laughs> After Smash Bros, it's Russian roulette. You gotta do this right now, man. <laughs> Job. You never get a normal delivery job. In the spring truck. Oh god, now the jingle's stuck in my head. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, what's your favorite? I like that they have a passenger wheel. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Stop moving it! I'm gonna move it! You just set up the truck and I'm nowhere! Okay, okay. We gotta coordinate, otherwise the wheels are just gonna start <laughs> grinding. <laughs> Pretty good. Yeah, right? The sound effect? I, uh, I worked in a mechanic shop for a while and I heard a lot of speech and sounds. Before I drove the spring truck, I didn't have a job. Really? <laughs> this is my first job. Aww. Well, well, Aww welcome. Me? I mean, like, welcome to the job world. Okay, well, thank you. I was, I mean, trying to be nice. I mean, sometimes your first job's kind of shit. Like, like this job. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, I kind of enjoy it. Do? Yeah, you get to you get to see new people, you get to bounce new places. No. Well, I give I'll give you that to you. We're surely bouncing new Stop! <laughs> I am very sorry! This is my first I think job customer. Daddy, Hit the brakes. Daddy, when is it gonna be my turn? I wanna go on a bouncy ride! Oh god, customers. <laughs> I may have told my child that my job is a ride. Uh, honey, did you lie to her? I may have told my wife also that my was Did you lie to me? I also told them where we were going. <laughs> this is going to get longer and longer the more people in the future. So, speaking of children, um, children make me think of, you know, old things that you like learn when you're a kid and it kind of goes with you uh, as an adult. And one of the things that I take with me as an adult is like, I get really like, Nervous when people like pee in urinals right next to me. Is any other guy having that? Yeah. It's, so, it's so weird, right? Um, so today I was going to the bathroom and it was the one booth that only has two urinals. So you know, already starting with disaster. Um, and some guy comes in. I'm like, okay, I'm just not gonna do anything. I'm just gonna stare at the wall in front of me. I'm just gonna go. And he's a freshman. I could already tell because he's wearing like um, like gym shorts and he tucked in his shirt. Um, you know, nothing wrong with that. If that's what you're into. Um, but the thing that caught me off guard the most and that made me like jump, literally jump, was that when he was done, he like was getting his shorts already and he just karate kicked the little handle thing to flush the toilet and just walked out. <laughs> it's. I was like. Jeez, the people they let into RIT these days. <laughs> but yeah, um, I don't like pee next to people. Yeah. <laughs> 
good. A lot of water. <laughs> Keeping up the steady stream of life. I'm waiting for mine to start. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, it'll come to you. It always does. That's not what I want coming out. I'll cheer you on. That's super weird. <laughs> really? You're getting real close, dude. I haven't moved in a while. I think you're just getting paranoid. Sidling over. Yeah, I'm just shifting side to side, I swear. Yeah, you're <laughs> I'm in stage fright, dude. Y'all, it's all about getting over your fears. <laughs> you just get out there. You just get out there and you're like,
I'm not going to say emotions. I'll do my best. Yeah, you got to do your emotions right now. I'm going to let you steal my emotions. It's all about individuality. Exactly. That's what being a badass is. I'll put my keys in Rule one, be yourself. Rule two, badass. Alright. Toast. T-O-S-T! unscrewing every time I twisted it, <laughs> but only from the inside. The outside's perfectly fine. So what this means, uh, and I, I mention this because it's a left-turning door to move the lock, and uh, in case you're not familiar with the rhyme, it's lefty-loosey, righty-tighty, and so on a couple of occasions now I've come really close to unscrewing my own doorknob and it not being able to open, because if you unscrew it too far, then suddenly you can't screw it into the right anymore because it just keeps going. And I could be locked in my room forever. I recently discovered that. Fun fact. <laughs> Dude, um, I don't want to alarm you in any way, but I've just noticed every time I use this stove, uh, the curtains behind the stove uh, seem to uh, light into flame. <laughs> <laughs> but it's it's fine. They were just smoldering a little. I just it just took like a damping of uh you know just, and so. Uh, so, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what? This is the worst house of rent ever! 
Then I'm don't use the stove anymore. No, you still touch no, it. No, it's really fine. Like all you gotta do is just give it a tap or two, and like you you, you can you can muddle through. <laughs> <laughs> let's let's just like put the curtains like away from the stove. Oh, they won't stay there. I mean, you don't have to be excessive about it. <laughs> I made Easy Mac the other day, and like, it was fine. You can make Easy Mac in the microwave. Yeah, but I like it on the stove. You know, come on. <laughs> I know, you, it you tastes better on the stove. stove. It tastes better on the stove. Yes, hot dogs better on the stove. Hot pockets better on the stove. Yeah. I know. Easy Mac's apparently better on the stove. It's so good. It's really easy. You want to do... What do you want? Are you hungry? Uh, I'm hungry. I'm not hungry enough for that house to burn down. You're such like a worry boy. Um, I just don't really want to have to pay for damages. Why? Uh, we don't have to pay for it. We're renting. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's not really a problem so much as just like a, a side effect of like cooking. I'm gonna call that off. <laughs> okay. And you're gonna call it side effect of cooking. There's some. They got um, shower upstairs, boiling water every time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna let you guys know that like peels the skin off your body. <laughs> Dude, your arm is freaking red. I know, right? Check this one out. <laughs> <laughs> It's not that bad. It's not that bad! <laughs> China, but we're reaching danger depths. Timmy, I really don't think this was a good idea. Mom's gonna get mad. Well, on the bright side, she has, uh, she has, uh, give me, give me a second up there. She's blind. She, this isn't good. There's a large hole halfway to China in our front yard. Mom's gonna be mad if she comes back. She could sell it for a place to put landfill stuff. <laughs> she'll be rich. She'll love us even more. I don't know. I... We could just start throwing trash in there right now and she would just come out here and love us. Okay, I'll get your nickelback collection. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Excuse me? Someone's stuck you out the door. Hey guys, it's your blind mother. Dinner's at 11. That's on YouTube. Bye, blind mom. <laughs> so... You already... You fucking do it! Yeah, I haven't heard it hit the bottom though. I think that's... Is that a nickelback? <laughs> Did we just? We couldn't have reached China, but we might have reached mole people. <laughs> you know, aren't mole people blind? Is mom a mole person? <laughs> no, no, no. No, no, no. no she that couldn't was that be. Flammable she couldn't be. You have discovered my terrible rodent secret. <laughs> <laughs> Does that mean wormhole people? No, your father's a human and it takes after the father. Why oh. am I? <laughs> a human. It takes after the father. Oh, is, that, is that Linda? <laughs> Dorothy? <laughs> you guys broke into Dorothy's house? <laughs> we didn't mean to. It was Timmy's idea. It was our, both our idea. We worked together as a team because we love you. Yeah. <laughs> questions about this mole thing. Okay, shoot, I'm here to answer because I love you. Wait, so like, how did you get up here? I dug it. How do you guys know about Nickelback? All the way from town there. Everyone knows about Nickelback. Do you guys have any like cold black? <laughs> there was a pop music sensation in the early 2000s. How would I not know about Nickelback? Wow, they really hit bottom. <laughs> <laughs> That's our show. <laughs> 